hello everyone welcome once again to our video tutorial so uh, in this video tutorial today uh, we will show you and guide you how to create a manual sitemap now uh, if you don't know uh, what is sitemap site up sitemap is uh, uh, most likely important for your site in order for your site to be able to uh, optimize so that's one of the requirements to have a sitemap now uh, if, if you check what is sitemap you can visit here at uh, sitemap.org and you have the, de the whole definition here now uh, here in this video uh, I will show you and guide you how to manually create a sitemap without adding any extensions to your site uh, is, is quite simple and easy task actually but uh, if, if you are uh, quite new to Joomla and what is sitemap, then it might be, you know, uh, 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 need some adjustment from your end uh, how you can uh, create this one. Uh, anyway, guys, uh, if, if, if you like this, uh, uh, like notifications here, notification bar, so like if you have announcement for your site in Joomla, so you can add this one. So you can download it uh, through our site directly uh, here. So it's, uh, you can get it here. It's sticky bar horizontal module. So you can get that. Uh, all right, so uh, now let's go back here uh, to create a sitemap. So, uh, to create a sitemap, uh, I will show you uh, tips and tricks. Uh, first is you can follow this kind of structure in a sitemap. It's, it's just repeated actually. So here, uh, if I go up here, uh, you need this type in your notepad++ and then you can save this all in that XML format. Now, uh, this is your site link here, and then you can put also a menu, uh, the, the link also here. So any link on your site, uh, you can add them, all right? So, so this, this is, you can, you can add as many sitemap as you want. That's, uh, manually created right there but there's also a quick way how to manage this if uh, uh, if you check this site here uh, xml.sitemap.com well uh, there are free and there's also uh, pro but you what you can do is you can use this free simple uh, <coughs> sitemap and uh, it has a limit actually up to 500 pages uh, <clears throat> so if, if, if you want to uh, expand more then you can manually do it like this uh, for the rest of the pages you can add them manually but I, I'll show you a sample like this domain we need to add so it's quite simple just add them like that and click start then uh, it will crawl to your site and check whatever sitemap you have right there so as you can see it's creating right now and then once it is created you can download them uh, it's free so you can click here now it's complete it says complete and view sitemap so here you have all the sitemap uh, that you want so you can follow this procedure actually download your XML sitemap you can click this one to download and then upload them into the root folder of your site so actually this sitemap is uh, regardless if you are Joomla WordPress or uh, whatever uh, website you have uh, you can you can use these tools actually all right so uh if if you have that uh you can upload them okay so it, it's an uh sitemap xml format so let's assume 
this one, site XML format, you can upload them to your root folder. So uh, here, you can upload them in your root folder. So assuming, uh, well, you can go to your cPanel or your, you can use FTP and then uh, just simply upload and uh, here you can put it here so here today I just made uh, an upload as an example so it is here sitemap.xml okay so once you you upload that there's another step that you need to uh, modify you need to find this name uh, robot.txt now uh, you cannot find this in the procedure in uh, when you create sitemap, but if you're using Joomla, uh, you need to modify this one. You need to edit that one, and then uh, you need to add it uh, here. I'll I'll show you the uh, robot SDX. So one of an example is uh, you have this is the, by default you have this in your Joomla. What you need to add is just like this sitemap colon https your domain name whatever it is then backslash sitemap.xml so after that you need to save it right so here you need to save it once it is saved then that's it you're ready to go you your, your site has already a sitemap okay so that's how easy uh, to, to create a sitemap do not forget to add it in robot.txt, alright? And upload the sitemap XML to your cPanel. So I hope you find it uh, informative. And uh, uh, we have a lot of videos that will uh, guide you and train you for your website development. So please check them out. And uh, please do not forget to follow and subscribe. Thank you for watching and see you in our next video tutorial. Goodbye.